welcome to this Pink 60 News seasonal special on Amnesty International. In 1961, British lawyer Peter Benenson set up Amnesty to fight for the rights of prisoners of conscience. Since then, the charity has expanded to fight for the rights of oppressed people all around the world. In 2017, following a campaign for the rights of intersex children, the Californian government became the first in the US to introduce a third gender option on birth certificates. The Gender Recognition Act was signed on October 15th, paving the way for additional protections. On August the 1st, gay human rights activist Ali Farouz was detained by Russian authorities pending deportation back to Uzbekistan, accusing him of working illegally as a journalist. The European Court ordered a halt to his deportation following a campaign by Amnesty. In November, genderqueer bodybuilder Su Fung Law was part of Hong Kong's successful bid to win the 2022 Gay Games. Su Fung identifies socially as male but competes in female competitions and with Amnesty's support works to change the perception of gender identity in Asia. Amnesty also supports the fight for equality across Africa. They continue to put pressure on the Egyptian government to release over 30 gay men jailed after a rainbow flag was displayed during a concert in Cairo. Well, that's all for this festive special. Join us again next time for more Pink 60 News.